guys, it's Luke here and welcome back to another video. We have another Astra VXR on the channel today. This specific car has had a whole host of work done to it. It's running 533 brake horsepower. It's fully built, engine and gearbox. And uh, yeah, I'm actually a little bit apprehensive going at it because it's an absolute beast. Of course, we are joined with Vinny, the owner of the car, who has done pretty much 99% of the work himself on the car, which is very cool. We'll introduce him, get him on camera, and he can basically walk us around what he's done to it. And then we'll head out on the roads and experience this 533 brake Astra VXR. Okay, so we're joined now with Vinny, the owner, the madman who has built this absolute oh. machine. It looks stunning, mate. It looks Thanks absolutely stunning. Cheers. I really enjoyed my time, uh, my first experience in an Astra VXR recently. So I'm, yeah, yeah quite excited, yeah, apprehensive about experiencing this. It's going to be with how much power it's got. But we'll dive straight on into the engine bay. Where I mean, look at this. It looks absolutely nuts. If you can remember anything, yeah, then yeah, uh, then yeah basically give yeah. us a run through this right. absolute well, monster. Basically, the engine's had a full uh, rebuild, top to bottom. Yeah. Uh, block's been wedged, decked, uh, it's got the uh, forged pistons in it, mm -hmm. forged com rods, racing bearings, uh, the head's sort of uh, stock still at mm -hmm. the moment. It's running the enhanced performance kit, which has got the Garrett G3660 uh, turbo, uh, all from enhanced performance. Yeah. Um, it's got uprated fuel pump, uprated intake fuel pump, also running meth. Yep. as well, uh, which is all fully done by myself. Down there. That's the external uh, fuel uh, filter because obviously you had to uh, cut the one out from the tank. Oh, uh, okay. Yeah, uh, yeah, yeah. Just to uh, yeah get it running cleaner. Mm -hmm. Gearbox is fully rebuilt. Uh, it's got the Gen 2 um, uh, bearing upgrade on it because mm -hmm. they do suffer from the uh, bearings because they're too, so uh, small, okay. basically. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's why they call them the chocolate box. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> um, and the flywheel is a VVT light and balance flywheel mm -hmm. with a four paddle uh, racing clutch yeah, in it. Yeah. It's got the EDS um, manifold on there, mm -hmm. the inlet, 533 on map four. Okay. Oh, so you've got switchable maps on it? Yeah, as well. yeah. Yep. got four switchable maps. Nice. The first one starts off at 402 brake horsepower. Yeah. The second one goes up to 475 brake horsepower. Yeah. And then the third uh, map goes up to 518 with or without meth. Okay, yeah. Uh, so that, it, that it's not actually reliant on it. Yeah. And the last fourth map is uh, 533 yeah. with full meth. So Mega. yeah, it is a bit of an <laughs> Absolutely animal. Absolutely, you got a screamer on it as well. Yeah, it? yeah, it's got the external screamer as yeah, well, pointing just, downwards. Yeah, I tucked way down in there. Don't that's know if it. See it. Yeah, I had it going through the bonnet at one stage. But <laughs> <Did you? laughs> yeah, I, I wanted the uh, fiberglass bonnet. Yeah, on there, that looks cool. It's yeah. I mean, visually as well, the car looks stunning as well. Really, Cheers. really nice colour. Nice low line kit on it yeah, as well, cannons, yeah. everything like that. Uh, wheels wise though, moving round, what are we yep. running at the moment? Uh, they're bowlers, uh, they're mm -hmm. quite a rare one because they're 19s on okay. these. Yeah. Uh, normal uh, Astra VXRs, they're normally running the 18s on yeah. them, but I managed to get over a set of 19s that fit. It's running the eight pot uh, ca uh, case bolt front brakes yep. upgrade with the stud conversion on it. Moving on to the side with the lower side skirts. Yep. Uh, yeah, they're like from well. GC Aerodynamics. Mm -hmm. The rear is pretty much stock with braking wise yeah it's got a full three inch cobra exhaust system all the way yeah. through yeah turbo back turbo yeah. back yeah all the way through on the rear you've got the dna rear lights yeah you've got the uh rear aerofoil from track car aero mm -hmm. uh, which they actually made and the rear diffuser is from gc aerodynamics again great help getting those uh, out yeah. to me on short notice and you bought the car stock? Yes, well. it was completely <laughs> stock. One lady owner from you. Yeah. Um, yeah, she probably won't remember it from <laughs> now how it looks. But <laughs> yeah. Um, yeah, it was uh, totally box standard, uh, mm. running standard power, unmolested. And I wow. decided I wanted to uh, go for a bit of fun, basically. Yeah, no, absolutely, absolutely. Of course, there's a whole interior build as well, which we'll oh, get yes. to yep. when we're out in the car. Yep. Um, but yeah, I think if, if that's pretty much everything yep. from the outside, yep. I think we'll, we'll hop in. Yeah, yeah, no and, problem. Uh, yeah, go have some fun. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> That's 
screamer oh, sounds yeah, incredible. Yeah, I've got in. <laughs> That's small even at low RPM well, as well. Too, as well, yeah. There's just so many noises going on. So much going on. There yeah. is, yeah. You've got to hold on as well, haven't you? Yeah, oh, yeah, yeah. You've really got to hold on. They call them dicks finders. <laughs> yeah. But that's screaming my head. <laughs> Another one of these, which was Tim's car, yeah. and I really enjoyed it. Do you know they go under the radar? These things, I reckon. They are, aren't they? I They're very they underestimated. Like we were just saying, they've aged really well as well. I think. Yeah. Oh yeah. Definitely. Definitely. But, um, I mean, even up till now, like I said, the look of them is so appealing. Yeah. Up to now. As yeah, well. for sure. For sure. So that was what map was that then? Uh, that, that last one was uh, map two. That was map two. Yeah, map two. So that was uh, uh, four seventy. Not... <laughs> that yeah. was 470? Yeah, yeah. <laughs> I thought that was 530. <laughs> yeah, no, no. Set of corbo buckets. Yeah. Bolted cage at the back as well. Yeah, that's right. Yeah. Um, Bolting cage. Which you did yourself, didn't you? Uh, yeah, 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 yeah. Short shifter as well. Yeah. The Gauges uh, and things like one. that. You got the three pillar pods. Yeah. You got the oil pressure, water temp. Everything you want. Uh, you yeah. Want to see. Done all that myself. Yeah. The door cards. As you can see, I made myself. Yeah. Saved quite a lot of weight out of the thing as well. Yeah. I'd imagine. Yeah. Well, the last time I had it near weight was just just a bit over eleven. Really? Something That's like, yeah. proper light. Yeah, it is, yeah. Wow. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> that sounds so good. It's savage, <laughs> isn't it? That's off the limiter. Yeah. <laughs> See an underpass, here you go. <laughs> yeah, that's it, yeah, yeah. Yeah, it's, it's just absolute fun. It brings yeah. joy to you every time you drive it. If you're ever down, you want a bit cheering up, just jump yeah, in it. Yeah, that's what it's all about, isn't it? Yeah, that's what it's all yeah. about, building cars, making them unique and that, making it, it make you happy, isn't it? Exactly, exactly. Yeah, I mean, you absolutely. see everybody else doing it, it's like, why not? Yeah, 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 for sure. Go. Yeah, <laughs> yeah, absolutely. <laughs> Hold my beer. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> One of these builds that I built in my head, and people were saying it's not going to work. You're going to have so much turbo lag. It's mm. going to be unbearable to drive. Oh, I'll be honest yes. with you, it really has worked out so yeah. so well. Because I suppose there's not many people that push the boundaries of of these. I suppose. I no, mean, I don't really. I'm not really that clued up on the space, but yeah, I can't imagine there's there's loads around which have 
done like a proper yeah. like mental build on oh, it. Oh yeah, I mean there's there's a couple out there at the moment like yeah. uh, over 600 breaking or whatever. Okay, like. yeah, yeah, yeah. I mean this this itself is going in uh, the end of May for going over 600 brake wow, with okay. a standalone ECU <laughs> um, for a bit of safety basically because yeah, at yeah, the yeah, moment. Yeah. I don't want to kill it or go too, too mad because mm -hmm. it's got no real safety on it. Sure, yeah, Would we'll you... have to get it back on then. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> once, yeah, yeah, that's it, <laughs> definitely, definitely. Once, but... it's, uh, once it's all done. Thank you very much for for bringing it down and, and letting me share it on the on the channel today. Yeah. I really appreciate it. You do, of course, have a channel for yourself. Yes, so, I do. Um, below, I'll leave the link to that as well as uh, Vinny's Instagram as well for you guys to go and check out. Plenty of content across both those platforms of this car. Um, but yeah, that is it for me today. I hope you guys have enjoyed. If you have, please do make sure you leave a like and make sure you subscribe for all the adventures 